What is a Dakini Goddess? A Dakini is a manifestation of freeing's power in lady form. Sometimes they are lovely and every so often they are wrathful and hideous and embellished with skulls. Because they constitute liberations, they regularly are depicted naked and dancing. In Tibetan word for Dakini is Khandroma, which means sky gods. Among the expertise teachings of Bajrayana Buddhism are many reminders to no longer be fooled by means of appearance. What can seem horrifying or even significant is not necessarily evil, however can be there for our benefit. Nothing illustrated these precepts higher than Dakinis. A Dakini is a manifestation of freeing electricity in girl shape. Sometimes they are stunning, and from time to time they may be wrathful and hideous and ordained with skulls. Because they constitute liberations, they frequently are depicted naked and dancing. In Tibetan words, for Dakini is Khandroma. Because of this sky gods in Buddhist Tantri, iconic Dakinis assist arrows completely happy energy in a practitioner's remodeling defiles mental state or clashes into enlightened consciousness in Vajrayana iconography prasna. Awareness is regularly depicted because the human's principles to be joined with upaya or skillful means. The masculine principle, thus the liberation of female Dakini is the boundlessness of Sunyata, emptiness that the perfections of know-how. Origins of Dakini, venerables of Dakini seems to have first merged in India, someday between the 10th or 12th century, the authentic Dakinis may additionally have been the female consort prevent in Yap Yam Napsods. About the identical times, Dakini also regarded in Hindu arts and memories at the starts as evil and malevolent spirits, but it becomes within Buddhist Tantra that Dakinis develop into richly complicated archetypes of releasing energy. The Dakini tradition was transmitted from India to Tibet. And today, the Kinis are maximum carefully associated with Tibetan Buddhism. The Kinis also are discovered in Japanese Shingon Buddhism, where they got here to be related to foxes. In Japanese folklore, foxes have many magical residents and may take the shape of humans. Classifications of the Kinis. Dakinis may be the enlightened or unenlightened and unenlightened Dakini is once in a while referred to as a worldly Dakini. A worldly Dakini continues to be caught within the cycles of samsara and may appear as a form of trick star. But most of the times when we are speak me approximately Dakinis, we are speak me about enlightened ones, also known as know-how Dakinis. Dakinis play many specific roles in Vajrayana and may be identified in many ways. However, regularly they are sorted into four essential relations. These four are sacred, inner, outer, and outer outers. On the name of the games stays, the Dakini is a manifestation of most diffuse country of mind skill intimately in maximum Tantra Yoga. At the inner degree, she is a meditation duty or hidam, an expression of the maximum primary natures of the practitioners. The outer Dakini manifests as a physical body, which can be the physical body of the practitioners who has found out himself as her, as self-defense, dualities melt away. And the outer Dakini is a Dakini in human shape. Probably a teachers or yogini. Dakini are also the categorized in keeping with the five Buddhas household, illustrated with the acts of the five Dhani Buddhas, as they sometimes related to the three components of the Trikaya. However, sorting iconic Dakinis into rigid classifications is to overlook them. 
more than the sum things as the kinetics represent dynamisms and energy they are the energy that brings about transformation they can take place in many bureaucracy together with as yourself they are fierce and frequently horrifying and don't agree to expectancies wrathfulness in westerns are traditionally benevolence brings are depicted as lovely and malevolence ones are ugly however the art work of asia don't constantly absorb that samples the many wrathful characters depicted in buddhist arts along with wrathful deities often are protector and teachers their appearance is a manifestation of energy and even the ferocity however no longer malevolence the symbolism associated with the wrathful beings may also confuse the uninitiated viewers for example when a takinis is son dancing on a cross the cross does not constitute tying however rather and lack of know how and the ego many iconic figures can appear in both peaceful and wrathful factors for example the commonly beautiful tara and archetypes of compassion every so often manifests as black tara who can resemble the black dancing dakini within the photo above black tara features to push back evil now not propose a in their wrathful appearance dakinis are corresponding to dhamapalas who in tibetan mythology regularly have been the former demons who converted to buddhism and become dhamma protectors The Dhammapala's Mahakala is the wrathful forms of Avalokiteshvara, Bodhisattva of compassion, the one famous Dhammapala who is human, Palin Lama, is frequently also called a Dakini. Other prominent Dakini, the Dakini Bajra Yogini, who can appear as numerous other beings, is one of the earliest Dakinis. and is considered to be the supreme duty of all tantris regard and goddesses niro dakini is a particularly fierce dakini of early bajrayana sima mukha is a lion headed dakini a girl's manifestation of padma sambhava